Welcome to California Care. Today I'm going to be sharing with you a great instrument that I utilize in local anesthetic, particularly if a block has failed uh, normally on a lower arch and we really can't get any tooth to get numb, even if you have given mylohyoid injection, lingual and bong buckle and uh, inferior alveolar or even gout gates. Occasionally it does happen. This injection can be used to deliver the anesthetic right into the PDL and anybody who has tried to do that knows that this, it takes a lot of pressure to inject any fluid into PDL space. This particular instrument is designed with safety in mind. What you would need to do is, is you unscrew it and in this little container you would slide your local anesthetic ampule inside and once you have slid it in you would tighten it. Don't put the needle yet. Once you have tightened it, then this one-way clicking mechanism, you push it in a little bit till it engages at the plunger action of your carpio. Then you attach your needle to it. And the way it works is every time you squeeze this, the plunger would get engaged deeper and deeper and deeper every single time and it keeps a pressure there. You see? and the fluid will keep on coming out from the needle tip with a lot of pressure till you utilize the holes ampule and this is how it goes once you're done injecting one the tooth should be numb all around normally what I've noticed is all you need to do is maybe give one or two clicks on every tooth surface like on the mesial facial you give one click on mid facial you give the second click on distal fascia, you give the third click, and you can do the same thing on the lingual three points. So with six clicks, you should be able to get the whole tooth numb very nicely, and you should be able to work peacefully in that tooth. In order to redo it, you would need to reassemble it in this particular model and reinsert it in the back, and you would have to tap out the local anesthetic ampule and insert a new one. But if you take a look at this whole scenario, you have a lot of clicks available. So if you use one, two, three, four, five, six, you should be able to numb this tooth again and again, and you would not need to uh, deliver the whole carpule to the patient. Very little amount is needed at one time, and you should be able to get immediate anesthesia. In certain cases, we have talked about that you would need to give the anesthetic intrapulpally. Um, in, in those instances also, you can use uh, the same uh, ligma ject and you should be able to deliver the anesthetic holding it nicely like this straight into the pulp chamber if you have modified the needle. Hope that helps.